New details on the six North Carolina men charged with planning terror attacks. The U.S. Marshal's Office says all six have now been moved to the Piedmont Regional Jail in Farmville, Virginia. A federal judge ruled yesterday that Daniel Boyd, Dylan Boyd, Zachariah Boyd, Hyson Sharifi, Omar Hassan, and Ziad Yagi are flight risks and a threat to the community based on their charges. The seventh suspect, Anis Sabasik, had his case postponed until a new translator could be found and his new lawyer gets caught up. He is still being held at the Wake County Jail. Suspect Anissa Basic has been ordered to remain behind bars leading up to his trial. Now, his hearing was delayed until this week because of a language barrier. An interpreter needed to be brought into the courtroom for him. The government is alleging that Sabasic is part of a conspir conspiracy to commit terrorist acts overseas. And in evidence that was presented during last week's hearing, you can actually hear Sabasic's voice on tape talking about those terrorist acts. Now, there was new evidence presented today about alleged criminal activity from Subasic while he still lived overseas. The judge said he questioned some of that evidence and he was not going to use it as a determination factor today. Also, Subasic had been asked to be released into his father's custody uh, leading up to the trial. However, the government did point out that his father is currently under investigation for a shoplifting charge and that he would not be a suitable choice. In the end, the judge simply said that there is too much evidence that this is too serious of a charge and he wanted to keep Subasic behind bars. Now we do not know where he'll be heading to prison for the time being. However, his six fellow terror suspects have been moved to a jail, uh, to a prison in Virginia at the federal courthouse. Loretta Benitti, News 14, Carolina.